Magnesium sulfate, a drug that we routinely encounter in our labor rooms. It is the drug of choice for severe preeclampsia for prevention of convulsion as well as the drug of choice for treatment of convulsion in antepartum or postpartum eclampsia. The mechanism of action is that it reduces the motor end plate sensitivity to acetylcholine and thereby uh, reducing the neuromuscular junction irritability. The therapeutic range is 4 to 7 milli equivalents per liter. When there is toxicity, the first sign of magnesium sulfate toxicity is the loss of bilateral patellar reflex, that is patellar tendon reflex or the bilateral knee jerk reflex is lost. The second sign is the reduction of the uh, respiratory rate less than 12. Next is the uh, reduced urine output less than 30 ml per hour and the last one will be chest pain or the uh, finding of heart block on ECG. Whenever you find or suspect uh, magnesium sulfate toxicity, immediately hold the drug. Then you can send the serum magnesium levels for testing and give the antidote that is calcium gluconate. It is given as 10 ml uh, as uh, in the form of 10% solution IV. Contraindications to uh, magnesium sulfate include myasthenia gravis, impaired renal uh, function and pulmonary edema. So whenever you are giving magnesium sulfate, uh, be very careful and check the urine output, check the knee jerk, uh, check the respiratory rate and then only administer the Maxilf. In fact, it is always advisable to prepare a Maxilf chart in front of the uh, patient's uh, bed head ticket so that it is easy to monitor at which level uh, you had encountered a toxicity or after how many doses. We have various regimens for giving magnesium sulfate. The most commonly uh, 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 followed is the Pritchard regimen, but other regimens include the Zuspan regimen also. Remember, this is a very important topic for knee PG and very practical uh, topic for the postgraduates.